Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we are going to be going over what we need to do for the last push coming into the weekend. Um, these mega seasons have been absolutely wild, and it's been frustrating at times. Yesterday I was a little bit frustrated, so we're gonna we're gonna cool it a little bit here today and just go over the strategy and the plans and focus on getting you guys into diamond, into 22, maybe into 23 if the stars will align for us. But uh, yeah. So you guys haven't already appreciate it if you throw in that code chicken into the shop. Um, does help to support the channel. And whoops, I meant to click shards. Um, we have oh, we got heroic effort. I will be buying that. Not right now because my email will show up on the screen, but I will get that at some point. If you guys are too, then I appreciate it if you throw that code chicken. It does expire every seven days. You guys know the drill. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna do a big video on the boom pass and the missions, and I do want to get all the rewards for this season, but. First priority is the Mega Season, and I think it should be for you guys too, because the Mega Season is going to going to determine a lot of your rewards. Now, here's where we're at today. So I opted for, you guys remember yesterday, I missed the multi-node, um, and I went with the Rockets. I don't know if that's really the best idea. Let's actually take a look at the last defense and see where we went wrong. So this is funny. So I was at 2190 here. And then lost this one, went to 6ER, lost, 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 lost. So 6ER, not too hot, not too hot. But let's take a look at our last one, because this is when I added in the um, the rocket launcher. So this is five rockets. And I think the rule of thumb for six is if you don't have the damage amp and the, um, I don't know, and the other multi-node, don't go to six, because it's just ultimately worse than five. And... You know, it's not that things are bad at 6, it's just the the way that the base, the deck layout is shaped on 5ER, it forces you to go one way all the way around to the other, whereas 6, you're just going in a straight line. Um, so yeah, it's it's not easy to get through. So this guy's using mechs, interesting. I have not messed around with the mechs, I've been using pretty well exclusively riflemen. Um, so maybe that's something we need to bring back into the mix a little bit. I've also been hiding. I have not been pushing today, as you guys saw by the log. A lot of the attacks were really spread out. Um, but let's see what happens here. Let's zoom in a little bit. So he goes max. And I mean, this guy got a fairly decent time, so let's see. I mean, if it's as simple as switching back to max, then I'd be alright with that. Then he delay drops one bomber on this side. Okay. Wow, and nothing takes down the mech. So I guess we have to get the boom cannons if this is going to easily beat us. Um. And that's even with the Doom Cannon, that's with the Blaster. He also had Bullet, that makes it a little bit different. Bullet's like, I don't know, like three mechs in one. Um, but something to try, something to try. So, did we go over the tech enough? I think what my plan is, I'm leaning two different ways. Yes, I could go Damage Amp right now, but I kind of want to get to seven and get to this first and then backfill. I don't think at this point the Amp is going to put me over the hump. If I was very close to 22, I probably would get the amp push for, like, I think the cutoff's going to be, like, low 22, high 21-ish. Probably similar to last season where I think it was, what, like, 21. Last season was, like, 21.30 or 21.19. Or it was 21.19, exactly. This season, I think it would be closer to maybe 21.50, 21.60. Um, so I probably already got it, you know, locked in, to be honest. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. I haven't looked in a minute. Um, I would imagine not that many people are 22. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'm still at 312 and I've done nothing but lose. So I mean, we're probably fine for the top 500, but going into next season, I do want to finish as high as possible and you guys should too, um, because we can max out the tech tree on like day one. It's going to be crazy. So um, yeah, let's see. Let's see. And I think we're going to go to set. So, let's see what we get matched up with. Actually, first, do we want to switch to boom cannons? I think we want to switch to boom cannons. Because without the amp, like we said, and as we just saw, the mechs are going to wreck us. They're going to wreck us with mechas. Um, of course, my rockets are moved in the wrong spot. Uh, that looks okay, right? I think. Wait, what? Did my engine just move up more? Let me watch that last replay back. 
Okay, there was a rocket over there. Okay, I'm I'm tripping out. I don't know what was going on there, but um, I'm gonna leave that rocket um, centralized, I think. And let's go with the boom cannon down here. Should be fairly obvious where they go, I think. Um, one over here, and then we'll go maybe one more. Um, maybe one more in here. That could be a good spot, I think. Or are they just going to rifle it down? Um, I don't know, actually. I kind of like it better over here on this side, I think. Let's see. I don't know where to put it. Let's put it in the middle. Sure. Why not? As long as they're not all shockable, then that's fine. Um... I mean, we might as well put this one back here, right? Why not? I don't really see the benefit of having it up forwards. And we can move these mines. Sorry, I'm doing too much base building here. Two and three. And you can go down there too. That looks a little bit better. I would like to win my first match at six here. I think that's going to be the goal for this video. Is hopefully we can get our first one. But um, if nothing else, we'll get our chest and get in and get out. But um, But yeah. You guys let me know what you're making out down below in that comment section. Um, but I think, yeah, I don't know. I think if you can go Damage Amp and Kavon, I think that would be really good if you already have Rifleman. If you don't, that's going to be, it's going to be tricky. But, you know, probably still doable to get a good Diamond push. Like, if you haven't got Diamond, um, that's the thing. Okay, so if you haven't got diamond yet, if you're still sitting in gold, I would definitely recommend going 6 ER, Damage Amp, and Kavon. I think that's going to be a good diamond push, an easy diamond push. Because if you save for 7 and you're behind in tech, you know what I mean, and you can only fill out half the good stuff through 7, I think you're going to get crushed. Because the 7s that I faced that went there early, smoked them. Like, absolutely smoked them. Even worse than 6 ER. It's super fast. Oh, I hate these bases. One... One, two, three, four. Let's get a little flary flary. Spark in the mixture. Now, I said in yesterday's video I did upgrade Spark to tick four. I'm also a little rusty because I haven't been playing uh, much today. And man, I was cooking last night. Like, I was going through these bases like 130, 130, 130, 130, no problem. I was just in that zone. You know how sometimes you get in that, in that zone of warships where it's just like. I don't know. You feel like you can kind of, you know exactly where to put the shocks. You know what's going to happen next. You know where to go. You know what to do. Um, I was just totally in that in that zone, and it happens sometimes. Usually, you have to play a lot to get in there. Um, but yeah, it was. Uh, I'm gonna go critters. I think. I let the shock blaster go. I'm not too scared about it. I don't know. I did. I hit it. Anyways, beautiful. Um, so maxing out the the GBE node. Definitely a big uh, a big help as well. I'm gonna try not to sneeze here. Definitely a big help maxing out the gunboat energy. Um, just so much more you can do, so much more you can do, and it makes the hits so much easier. Like I could spam here right now, but I kind of want to save critters uh, and shock for the very end if we can. So we can shock. Yeah, we can shock critter, critter, critter. Maybe reshock after we get this last engine. Let's see. I don't know if it would be enough to get everything down, um, but I think that makes sense. 110 GBs, so I mean, we'll get definitely one shock, maybe three critters. I think three critters is what's needed. Um, all right, let's see. And there's no rush on it, really. So we can take our time here, guys. They're good to come around the corner, that's fine. Alright, so we're going to go try to do this as fast as possible. So shock, critter, critter, critter. Did we get three? Yes, we got three. Nice. Don't hit that shock mine. Ooh, I underestimated how fast they would take down stuff. That flamethrower is going absolutely ruin us. Damn. Well, it was all a waste. But at least we wasted our time. Um, let's go spark. I think... So get, this is where the level 5 flare comes in, if you guys haven't maxed out your flares yet. Definitely helpful coming around these stupid corners here. 
And I probably, looking back on it, I probably could have got through that base faster had we um, used more GBE in the, in the death zone. Oh, we got a win. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. Sweet. Maybe not all whole biz lost, guys. Let's see what he did. He fizzled. All right, maybe the boom cannons were the way to go. Did he use mechs? I see a lot of bombers. I see rifles. Lots of guys coming at this from the from the top. I think going from the bottom is better. And I don't think split dropping is the way to go on the six yards, but I don't know. Haven't been getting being super successful at six yard, but um, yeah. So it is what it is. That's good. I'll take a dub for sure right now. Um, and then we got one more chest to go, and then we'll be ready to go to seven. But I'm definitely not going seven. Oh, no, we got two chests to go. Not going seven early. And then we also have the decision to make about heavy choppers because we don't have heavies, right? So how good are those going to be? Lots of decisions, lots of stuff to play out. A couple options for you guys. I do hope that helps you out. Let me know how you make it down below in the comments. And, um, yeah, appreciate you guys watching. Uh, make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. Catch the next one, guys. Check it out. Bear, bear.